this method, your significant other or your partner will have to match your vibration or match what you are exuding or they will be ejected. You have to try it. This works. How to manage any relationship by managing yourself. Keep watching as we go over some practical tips on how to manage any relationship and how you can get started today. Bonjour, welcome to La Clinique Moliere, where we increase awareness and improve the quality of living. I'm Rachel, I'm a family nurse practitioner. I'm also a certified nurse midwife, and on this channel, we talk about mindful living, self-development, and women's health. Let's get to it. On our last video, we talked about 21 days of love and how to manage any relationship. And I got some feedback on exactly how to carry out this 21 days and put it in action and um, how to do affirmations. So today we're going to discuss exactly step by step how to manage any relationship. So we talked about increasing your awareness for one. So you would have to decide that you how you want to be treated in that relationship. Decide your worthiness and decide how you want to move forward. So that's the first step is just deciding how you want to feel when you're with that person. Or if you're in a current relationship or a spouse or partner and you're not sure if you want to move forward with this, this love relationship or move forward with a friendship or with family. Um, so we're going to talk about practical tips that you can take starting today to address any love relationship or any relationship. So after you've decided, the next step is... <laughs> Words. The next step is to remember that what you desire desires you. We don't all desire the same thing. So if you desire, if you want more, if you want to do more, if you want to be more with this person, or you want to take it to the next level, or if you want to feel more love from this person, you want more love expressions, whatever it is, remember what you desire desires you back. So you're right on path. So the 21 days of love idea is designed to address any love relationship because you are starting with yourself. So you remember that your world is a projection of who you are. It's a mirror and reflection of who you are. So the secret is to become who you want to attract. Okay, so that is the secret. We talked about it last video, and we're just bringing it home because we're going to go through this step by step, you know, what you have to do in order to carry out the 21 days of love in order to match what you're desiring. For the 21 days of love, you're going to exude all things love. Remember, there's only two emotions ever really, fear and love. So you're going to exude compassion, passion, gratitude, servitude, benevolence, so all things love, and you're going to adopt all things love and reject all things fear, anger, anxiety, guilt, shame, resolve any relationship with these powerful steps. So the idea of the 21 days is just having a set time for spiritual practice, whether that be in the morning, midday, or at night. So spiritual practice is key for exuding love and for getting in tune with your authentic self and managing any relationship. So your spiritual practice will include daily for 21 days, you're gonna wake in prayer and meditation. So prayer is when you do all the talking to spirit, to God, um, you do all the talking, you put in requests, you do all the talking. Meditation is when you are listening within and you are listening to Holy Spirit guide. So you are, your spirit guide, you're getting instructions then. So meditation is really important. And I, I think it's really underused. Um, we know about the health benefits of meditation, but we also want to remember that we can get guidance. So even when you're meditating, you'll probably get guidance on what's the next step for this relationship or what should you do, or you'll get guidance for how to move forward. So listening and not doing all the chatter is going to be key during the 21 days. So there are some YouTube meditations of 21 days of love. So choose whichever one resonates with you most. And that's going to be your daily practice of your daily meditation. It could be 10 minutes, it could be five minutes, but what you're doing is setting the intention for attracting love. The next component of the 21 days of love is going to be gratitude. So gratitude is going to be key. 
every morning, every day, before you wake, so before you turn on the phone, before you check any email, before you do anything when you wake, definitely you want to have a gratitude practice in the morning. So pick a time that works best for you, and before you do anything, to have at least write down three things or four things that you're grateful for. You could say it or you can write it down, but get in the feeling of gratitude, and that's a big component of the 21 Days of Love. The next component of the 21 days of love is just being in tune with how you're feeling. So you're gonna, we're gonna be journaling. So daily journaling, writing down how you're feeling, being in touch and conscious and aware of how you're feeling. It's gonna be really key. Um, that's another key component to the 21 days of love. The next component, another really big one, is gonna be affirmation. So affirmations are so important. Remember, there's life and death in the tongue. There's power in the tongue, okay? And remember what faith is. Faith is the unseen seen, or you're calling things that are not as though they were. So that's where your affirmations are. So you're speaking life into any situation. So that's, you raise your vibration, um, and you speak life into it, and you're creating with your words and your how powerful they are okay so I am love I'm radiating love you know uh, love is attracting to me I'm attracting love so you want to definitely radiate um, and affirm what you want to attract as well another way to speak life into any situation or call things that are not as though they were is through the powerful scripting so power powerful you could say them and it also is nice to write them down as well I'm so happy and grateful now that I've attracted love and you can list the characteristics of what love feels like or what love looks like so be specific so that's also another great component of the 21 days of love and you're gonna do this consistently for 21 days if you miss a day you have to start over you have to decide how you want to feel okay you have to decide and you have to choose yourself lastly you want to do all things love so that includes being out with nature eating clean so your diet okay you want to exercise yoga so all of these things increase your vibrations research shows it has health benefits of increasing serotonin and all your happy hormones and um, so it's not only physically but mentally so that we are going to always bring home the mind body spirit connection so doing all things that are happy and loving for the 21 days by the end of the 21 days you can expect <laughs> to be high vibrating and anything that is not like itself will be ejected so you remember his ways are past our ways and higher than our ways so your partner or your significant other or that relationship or friendship will have to match what you're putting out or it will be ejected and the how of the ejection is not what you're concerned about you're not concerned about the how you know let god universe take care of the how your only responsibility is to remember and see it from the end so see how you're going to feel when you're with love the how of the execution is not your responsibility your own only job is to hold the love note for 21 days and to see the end from the beginning okay so visualizing while you're doing the meditation or visualizing while you're scripting and giving in the feeling and seeing the end from the beginning that's the biggest secret is relinquishing control going downstream it's the art of allowing and so we'll, we're gonna always bring it home but that is the secret so seeing it from the end from the beginning and not worrying about how it's going to be executed that does it for this video remember to hit the like button and be sure to share so we can increase the quality of living be sure to like and subscribe and comment below um, I definitely want to hear from you after the 21 days I want to hear what's working for you and I'll see you on the next video au revoir